Hey guys, welcome back. I'm doing another review for you guys today. This is going to be another Maybelline review. I'm doing um, two parts to the review. One is for the Elixir lip glosses, and the other part is for the Vivids lipsticks. So let's get started with the Vivids. Now, the Vivids are a collection of lipsticks from Maybelline that have this packaging. This is their classic packaging for all their lipsticks. However, this um, doesn't matter what color you get, the packaging is the same. And the Vivids are a very pigmented group of lipsticks. They have really unique, different colors, which is what I'm always looking for. Um, this is a like violet purpley color uh, called Brazenberry. And these lipsticks just have super, super, super pigmentation to them. And as you can see, that was the brazen berry just by itself. I mean, nothing. And it is a really cool color. It's a really unique color for me. I don't have a lot of uh, colors like this. I have a lot of pinks and reds and neutrals and dark berry colors. But I don't have anything violet like this, which is really, really fun to find. So um, this is the other one. This is a Fuchsia Flourish, I believe. For Fuchsia Flash. So it's just a pink color. It's a really, really bright pink color. And it goes on, they go on super, super smooth. I mean, they are very, very creamy. Very creamy, very, very pigmented, and just gorgeous. I love these lipsticks so much. I want to go back and get the red and the orange. I think those would be really fun colors. The red is like a fire engine red, and the orange is orange. So I don't have an orange color, and that's really unique to find. So... Um, I love these bright colors. I definitely would wear these like every day. So, uh, maybe not this one, but this one for sure. Anyway, those are the Vivids. They're very creamy, very, very luxurious feeling. And I'm not a big fan of the packaging, to be honest. Like, I'm not a big fan of this like whole top coming off. I'm more a fan of the, um... Of the lipsticks that are kind of like the these like the makeup geek ones where the lid just comes off and you have part of the that's really weird where you just have the um, the top that comes off and you know and then you have your lipstick inside like that and you don't have to take the whole entire top off so that's the kind of lipsticks I like. I'm not really a big fan of taking the whole entire container apart. Other than that, don't, don't matter. These are great products. Um, I can deal with the lids and stuff like that. So those definitely get an eight for me. Definitely get an eight. The next uh, product from Maybelline that we have is the Elixir lip glosses. And you guys have probably seen the commercials for these on TV and they look something like this and if you turn them like this they kind of look like a lipstick and they're not they're a gloss um, I got three colors well I got these two colors when I got the vivids and then I got this one just um, like on a separate trip but this one is called rose redefined and I'm actually wearing that today and then this one is called fuchsia flourish and this one is called a vision in violet so let me swatch them for you this is the violet one this one goes along with the violet um, vivid that I got. So these are super duper 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 pigmented. You do not need a lipstick underneath these. You can just wear these by themselves. Bam. There you go. There's the violet. Like I said, again, super duper duper pigmented. Here's the fuchsia. Fuchsia is gorgeous. I love this color. Again, bam, super pigmented, very pigmented. And the Rose Redefined is a lighter version of the Fuchsia. It's just an everyday pink that I can wear. Whereas these are all, these other colors are more fashion-y. There's Rose Redefined, Fuchsia Flourish, and then the Vision and Violet color. These are so soft, okay? These are super, super soft on the lips. They look great. They spread great. The I looked at the doe foot applicator and I thought, 
But that looks all jacked, but it's not. It is so soft, the applicator. It, it doesn't even feel like you're using an applicator, to be honest, because you don't even feel the, the fur or the hair on there. It's really soft and it's really good and it's a really unique shape for an applicator for sure. Because when you look at other lip glosses, like say this Revlon one that I that I have, you get this kind of an applicator, which doesn't look that interesting. I mean it's a regular applicator. Um then you get other um lip glosses that have like, I think this one has a funky, yeah, this one has, like, the doe foot. That's a doe foot, and the doe foot, um, you can feel the hair when you put on the lip gloss. These, um, lip glosses, you cannot feel the applicator whatsoever, and that's a really good, a really good thing for me. So, these get a 9, in my opinion. I love these. I'm gonna go back and get a red and a really dark one and add them to my kit because these are really good. I actually used this one, the Rose Redefined, on a um, bride. Well, not on the bride herself, but on her bridesmaids. I topped the lipstick off with this, and it looked fantastic. And I just, I love these lip glosses, so I definitely recommend them, and I think you should too. Anyway, uh, that's all for now. Um, I should have this uploaded soon, and until next time, I will talk to you later.